So hi everyone, uh, I'm Bai Lu Ding. Uh, I'm from the Data Management, Mining and Exploration team and Microsoft Research. So our group mostly works on database, uh, database systems and data mining stuff. And today I'm going to talk about our project on how to automatically index in database for Azure DB. Uh, so this is a joint work uh, with my colleagues and my past interns. So, Indices are an important data structure um, for database systems where you, you can help navigate the data efficiently so that you can execute the queries efficiently. Um, but creating the right set of indices for a given workload is a very challenging task because it requires you to understand the database internals and also understand like how the workload look like for this particular database. So the goal of this project is how can we automatically manage and create the indices for millions of the databases in Azure DB. Now let's take a look at like how it works in this moment like without the automatic tuning on uh, work we're doing. So currently there is an expert who take uh, who look at the database and analyze what is the workload of the database and then the expert use uh, index tuning tool to come up with a set of indices as the index recommendation but it's not done here because the expert needs to analyze the recommendations from the tool and do some uh, trial and error in terms of like does this recommendation make sense and uh, what would be the best set of indices to create for this database and then it, uh, the expert finalized the indices to create for this database. Now the question is that you may ask is that if we already have the index tuning to why do we st still haven't automate the whole uh, process? Now the issue or the challenge is the index tuning to recommends the indices based on the estimated cost of the, de of, the the, of the benefit provided by this set of indices because it hasn't like without creating the indices it doesn't know like how much real improvement it will help for these queries um, but sometimes like it estimated it to improve the queries but it turns out to make the query even worse so in this case why we need an expert human in the loop to sort of automate this process uh, to, to sort of analyze this process so Given our goal is to automate this process for Azure DB, what are the new opportunities here? Now, in the cloud, we have the ability to observe the aggregated statistics from the execution of the database as they are running in the cloud, like uh, the statistics including like how the index have changed over time, what are the query plans, what are the estimated cost and true execution cost of the query. Now, the challenge here is that like given the wealth of such our, our rich data how do we actually leverage such data to get some insights to help the automate in this process now currently we have been looking at two directions in how to leverage such data one direction is like after we created the indexes and see uh, some query becomes more expensive than before how do we remedy such a situation based on the execution history of the database now the second direction is that if we like just react when the query regresses, that's probably already too late because the indices has already been created. Now, uh, what is uh, even more helpful is that can we prevent creating such indices that will lead to uh, the queries to become more expensive? Uh, in this work, we're looking at some of the uh, statistical knowledge technique to help with the prediction. Um, I think uh, that's about it. Um, if you have any questions or if you are interested in this topic, please welcome to talk to me offline as well. <laughs>